create an enlarged plan of an area within a floor plan in Revit, we can use view callouts. View callouts will allow me to have another view that I can adjust the visibility and graphic overrides and the scale to suit the needs of that project. When we look at our starting view, you can see that the room tags take up quite a bit of space within each of these rooms here. But when I add those room tags back in, you can see it's much more reasonable and gives me a lot more space for other documentation. That's because the view scale is different here. You may also know that, notice that the detail level is different in this view as well. That's because that's a view specific property that I can adjust in my callout view or in my overall plan view. Callout views can also be used for details in section. So if I wanted to add a detail specific to this condition here, I could do a callout. It could be a detail or even a digital wall section. And now I have a detail view for the edge of my floor at that location. I can use the same process to create a wall section for the wall here at Gridline A.